British Ministry of Defense FOD has blocked the planned release of a secret dossier detailing infamous UFO incidents that happened in the village of Kervine in Scottish Highlands in 1990. Kervine UFO sighting is considered to be one of the most controversial UFO mysteries in the history of Britain. It is claimed that Dossier contains the secret of a 100 feet UFO hovering over the Scottish village in 1990. Back in August 1990, two tourists were walking in the Scottish Highlands near Kelvin, Piglockery. Suddenly, they witnessed a strange rhombic object hovering over the nearby landscape. They managed to take pictures of the UFO before it flew away at a significant speed. The couple took six photographs of the UFO, chased by several military jets, and one were captured in the camera. Being equal to share what they had seen, the couple contacted the Scottish Daily Record and gave away both their story and the photos they took. Then, the journalist shared the negatives with the UK Department of Defense. It turned out that the tourists wasn't the only ones who had seen the object, the pilot of RAF Harrier jets also witnessed the phenomenon, again near Kevin, after being forced to be investigate this UFO. The former head of the UFO research project of the British Ministry of Defense and later turned whistleblower Nick Pope discovered a UFO, but the data were covered up by the authorities. Nick had been directed to project since 1991, during this time, he has repeatedly stated that a number of traces of aliens have been identified in the UK. The researcher explained that the work was not easy. Most of the data he found was simply rejected by the manager. Nick and Channel 5 recreated the color images of the incident. He said that military intelligence officers sent the images to JRIC which is the Joint Air Intelligence and Reconnaissance Center. We consistently play down the true level of our interest in UFOs, while all the time behind closed doors, we struggle to make sense of cases like Kevin's incidents. It is the UK's military center of excellence when it comes to image analysis. These intelligence officers concluded that the photographs were real, and no one had the slightest idea of what the UFO was. 30 years later, the dossier of the Ministry of Defense, including photographs, was scheduled for declassification and publication, which is typical for such documents. However, the release has now been postponed for another 50 years for unknown reasons. And Nick said, under the 30-year rule, the file should have been released on the 1st January of 2021, but if the ministry gets their way, it won't be released until the 1st of January 2072, an 82-year closure. By the time the world gets to see the file, the two witnesses will be dead. It is crazy. What are the authorities trying to hide? In the edited file, they also removed the names of the witnesses and their contact details. The UK's Information Commissioner's Office has lodged a complaint under the Freedom of Information Act, but it is on hold.